Hello all. Today I'm going to be making some egg salad. Salad. I'm going to be using the Epicure Rectangle Steamer. And I'm going to start out with just putting some eggs here in my steamer. Uh, these are extra large eggs. So I'm going to try four just to see how it does. And just putting them in. I'm not mixing it or anything like that. I have done uh, an egg frittata in the rectangle steamer and it's turned out beautiful and yummy. And I can link that below if you like. So I'm going to put my top on. Uh, these are silicone. They're FDA approved food safe. They can be put in the dishwasher. You can put them in the oven for up to 425 degrees. I'm going to start with three minutes. See how we do with three minutes. So yeah, if you've made egg salad, you know it usually is you boiling eggs, you peeling the eggs, and sometimes the peeling part can be a little bit of a chore. You know, you try all those little tricks that people tell you to try to make it easy to peel, and sometimes it works. <laughs> But you know, anytime I can use my steamers and in the microwave, yeah, I'm all in. So let me get some mayonnaise. That's what I, mayonnaise, I wish I had a little Dijon mustard. Sometimes Dijon mustard adds a nice little zing to your egg salad, doesn't it? And then I'm also gonna be using the Epicure Three Onion. The ingredients in the Three Onion is, <clears throat> Where's my ingredients? Onions, scallions, herbs, and chives. It is so yummy. Kosher check, non-GMO, gluten-free. My sodium is 0%, so I appreciate that. Let me get a mixing bowl. And yeah, what do you put in your egg salads? Uh, do you put the chopped onion? Do you put chopped pickles? Yeah, you do you. You do you. Let me get my salt and pepper. I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. And then I also want to get my Epicure, whoop, it sounds like it's exploding. My Epicure multi-purpose, my meat separator. So get that out in a hot pad. down the dog in my kitty cat hot pads yeah you know sometimes uh, you want something quick and easy and with this you know with an egg salad of course you can make yourself an egg salad sandwich um, any type of bread you want uh, you could wrap it up uh, in a tortilla you could do a lettuce wrap of course, just do a snack with some uh, whole wheat crackers. When you order and get your rectangle steamer from Epicure, it'll come with the card. And within the card, it'll tell you what uh, the approximate times are on your different things, like all of your vegetables. Of course, you can do seafood, salmon, shrimp, whitefish fillets, uh, chicken breasts. And so your times are on here and of course, it's going to vary depending on your microwave, uh, as we all know. So I always start a minute less than what the card says, because again, you can always add time. And but once once you've overcooked, yeah, it's done. Because I did start out doing it that way, and I found that uh, some of my vegetables were a little overdone and a little chewy, so I started backing off on my time and uh, got it down to where I wanted it to be, which is perfect, perfectly steamed vegetables. So I'm gonna do, open the top, and when you open your top, open it away from you, so you do not get burned. Let's see what we got. Well, the eggs look done. Well, then the yolk is exploding. <laughs> so that's how she turned out, folk. Folks, let me 
me get my meat separator and just chop this up. And if you have the, the larger multi-purpose steamer, of course you can do more eggs. So however much uh, egg salad that you would like. Yeah, if you already have the rectangle steamer and you have already used it over and over and over again and love the convenience and the ease of the rectangle steamer, man, go to the next level with the multi-purpose steamer. And if you haven't tried anything from Epicure, this is where you need to start. This is what I started with, was the rectangle steamer. Uh, and then again, you're gonna fall in love with the ease of it, um, how you're able to take fresh ingredients and quickly make something yummy uh, that you'll love and whoever you're cooking for will love. Okay, do a little bit of pepper. Yeah, like I told you before too, uh, I have done the Mexican frittata, which you just add some vegetables to and some cheese, and it turns out yummy. I have done uh, fish in this. I've done vegetables. Um, Joanne shared with us uh, that she did, she did hers all in one thing. She had her vegetables on the bottom, which she had broccoli and mushrooms, and I believe she had almonds too, and uh, then two chicken breasts, and so she had a perfect meal for her and her husband, and it was all in, in the rectangle steamer and done in about four minutes. Add a little mayonnaise. I'm using light mayonnaise. So how much easier is this than boiling and peeling? I know, right? <laughs> I know. All right, I don't know if you can hear the TV, Tom's in there watching one of his fishing shows. All right, well, let's try the taste. Taste is what it's all about. Oh, this is yummy. And the eggs, really, great texture on the eggs, just like you would if you had boiled and peeled. So when you order your rectangle steamer, I suggest the three onion, because you can use this in so many ways, so many ways. Uh, don't forget, if you order any size order by September 30th, I will gift you your choice of either a chocolate mud pie, the chocolatey temptation cupcake, or the carrot cake. So just place an order any size by September 30th, and then you'll be able to choose one of these. Order $50 or more, choose two. So I always appreciate y'all checking in with me today. If you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe and join my Facebook group. Those of you in my Facebook group, I appreciate you. And to all of you, happy healthy eating. Bye.